Okay, it's May 22nd, 2017. We are sailing up the river, going to our final destination outside of Shanghai. This river is full of ships, hundreds of ships everywhere. Very difficult to navigate. Um, out there is Shanghai behind that little city. Tanker. It's a tanker ship. You can see just behind us is a ship cutting across. Look at all the ships out there. Literally hundreds of ships in front of you, behind you. So it's very difficult navigation up this river. Gotta be very, very careful. Shipping container terminals everywhere, shipyards. Shanghai out there in the distance looks about 30, 35 kilometers away maybe. It's behind some other buildings right now. But it's a warm sunny day today. Maybe we can see a little bit of Shanghai now if we look over here. Hopefully in a couple days when we're at the hotel we can go into the city and see some. Shanghai is right out there. See this a really tall building. You can see part of it through all the cranes and everything. So that's Shanghai. There's one of the mates. He's from Poland. We'll take a quick look at the other side and then later on we'll try to take some more video later. It's gonna be a whole day transiting up this river, 13 hours or so. So we're gonna see more. Now I'm walking forward on the ship. This is one of our lifeboats. You can see all the boats, ships everywhere. That's just so many ships out there. A huge container ship cut right in front of us earlier. I don't know how we missed it. We just missed them. So we'll come back and see some more in a little while. There's a bulk carrier riding right along us. Looks like a Chinese ship. You can see the bulbous bow out of the water. And there's Shanghai again in the distance out there. like another bulk ship. Sailing the other way. I think it's a Chinese vessel. They're gonna sail right by us. Chinese version of Coast Guard here. Helicopter zone in the back. It's probably like a, I don't know if that's like Chinese Coast Guard or what, probably. Okay, we're looking back aft, down the river. See the traffic following us. And over here is a Chinese cruise ship terminal. Nice cruise ship and a really big terminal. Passenger terminal. Okay, continuing up the river. 
Here's a tanker port. Oil tanker. And atomic power station. It's all fuel terminal where tanker ships pull, pump off their cargo. And it gets stored in the tanks back there. Okay, continuing up the river here. We're uh, approaching a big bridge here. You see the same style of bridge all around the world. Not sure the name of the bridge, but uh, still going up the river here. So. Take a little more footage when we get closer here. Okay, so now we're upon the bridge here. It's a really nice bridge. You can see the cars. Really big suspension bridge. It's really cool. It's always fun to sail underneath a, a bridge on a large ship. If you go up to the top, you know where the ship is steered from, the bridge, you look up at the well, where the traffic is, the cars, it's not that far up there. You can see everything. You're really close to the top of the bridge. It's pretty cool to see. But right now we're on the, uh, what's called the B deck, one deck above the main deck on the ship, so not too uh, high up there. Get a little perspective here. Use the, uh, the frame here. You can see our speed compared to the bridge. See the markers. And here we go. So we're getting ready to travel underneath. You can hear the cars at this point. Here we go. So cool. And continuing up the river. Really nice bridge. Okay, and now facing the after end of the ship, you can see the bridge behind us. A little bit of wind back here. You can see that it's a beautiful day. Here's just another shot facing forward. And um, you can see all the traffic. This is what the river looks like the whole trip. Here's the Changjing, another Chinese ship. You can see how closely they are. We just honked our horn. So that probably indicative of someone is right in front of us. And you can see we're making a small turn to accommodate. So it's a... Uh, Gotta be very, very careful. Yeah, the Changjing Chinese vessel. And there's another ship coming up on our other side. Right here. You can see how tight it is here. 
right there. And we're almost a thousand feet long. So ships this big are traveling this close to each other. There's the bridge back there still. He's sitting really low in the water. There's the Chinese flag on the back. There's a ship that's spinning right behind us. The, the Hawaiian too. It's a bulk carrier. Here's a ship that's carrying uh, timber. It's carrying wood for whatever, probably to a, a mill where they're gonna make wood. Way out in the distance you can see, uh, I guess, residents where people live. And it's a little windy here, but up ahead, you can see a city coming up. Ship. I'm not sure what this is out here. You can see a lot of places where people would live though. Okay, so now we're going by another town. And on the top of this hill, really neat looking it's some kind of a almost reminds me of like a Japanese temple or something not sure what that is a little village over here and there looks like some kind of a sports venue or something that white thing looks like a big roof so that could be like a sports venue another large city And it continues on up. And then you can see where people live. On up even more. Right up here. A lot of, looks like, uh, like what people would live in. Take another little view here. It looks like something goes up the hill. Something that goes up the hill to get to that. Must be some kind of a lift that goes up there to get to it. Okay, now we're past the, the hill, which might have blocked a little bit of the view, so. It's a little better view of the city. The arena over there on the right. See the white roof? I'm assuming that's arena. It looks like uh, some kind of a big sports complex. It's a terminal for ships.